Hello, and welcome to Battletech. I had to uh, try and do this earlier at one point, and it crashed my computer, so I needed to try and fix it. Hopefully this time it won't crash it, and I needed to get Shadow Tactics done before I felt okay recording it and putting it on YouTube, given I don't want to have four series up at once, and I'm thinking about switching Tolba out for something else, another stealth game. Uh, so I can have stealth, I can have tactics, and I can have kind of water for now. But we're going to click new. Standard campaign. Start the game. Is the game okay? No, it's okay, it's okay. <whistles> Had to make sure there. Still waiting. I am Kamea of House Arano, High Lady of the Oregon Reach, Protector of Koromadir, and the Sword of Restoration. But I am not a hero, no matter what the stories say. A hero would have sacrificed more, compromised less. A hero would have done better. You know this, of course. You were there. My father used to tell me stories about the ancient times, about the Star League, a golden age of prosperity, upheld by the great mech warriors of old, guardians of the innocent, protectors of the peace. I always dreamed of following in their footsteps. I was too young to see the truth of things. After all, it wasn't heroism or a noble cause that won me the throne. It was hiring a mercenary, skilled enough, perhaps ruthless enough, to carry the day. Hiring you. I still don't know if you fought for honor or for the thrill of it, for belief in my cause or just in my money. But whether it was your noble heart or mercenary mind, your actions gave us hope. That makes you a hero in the eyes of history. Whether you believe it, that's up to you. I've seen that a few times now because of how many times I tried to get this to work, but it still has a good effect. 
I'm gonna read through this and try and make it through the tutorial this time without it crashing. The Oregon Reach is a small kingdom in the Rimward Periphery, a region of space that lies at the outskirts of the more densely colonized Inner Sphere. It is home to the Oregon Coalition, a federation organized around a parliamentary monarchy and ruled by the Arano family. For three generations under the rule of House Arano, the Oregon Coalition has remained a relatively peaceful corner of the periphery. It is here your story begins. I am from the, uh, I have all this decided already, even I've been through this. I am from the Magistracy of Canopus. Magistracy. Mech warriors who hail from the Magistr- er, from Canopus can run the gamut of skill and fighting styles, but they often favor clever and orthodox tactics on the field. While smaller than the successor states of the Inner Sphere, the Magistracy of Canopus is one of the major powers of the Rimworld Periphery. <coughs> Excuse me. The Magistracy is a matriarchal society led by Magistrix. This is an elected position open to any woman, but largely controlled by House Centrella due to the family's popularity. The Magistracy is, supports an open society that ensures the personal liberty of all citizens and their right to live their lives as they see fit. You are of noble birth. Though immigrants to the Regan Reach, your family soon established a comfortable presence in a small backwater system on the edge of a Regan space. By the time you were born, your family had become de facto ruling nobility of the system's only inhabited planet. You were the oldest child, heir to the family's titles, an ancestral battle mech, an old Blackjack BJ-1. This is where you met Raju Mastiff Montgomery, a veteran to the Succession Wars, whom your parents hired on for season to train you as a mech warrior. Raju was strict but capable was a strict but capable teacher, and you quickly became a skilled pilot under his tutelage. It was an uneventful life. Until the day after your 16th birthday when your family was betrayed. Your family was betrayed and its seat of power destroyed. You defeated the betrayers, but you were the sole surviving member of your house. Out on your own, you fell into the life of an inner sphere mercenary. Eager to get away from it all, you joined up with a minor inner sphere mercenary unit. Integrating yourself into the tight knit crew took time, but eventually proved your worth. You eventually proved your worth and became part of the family. Two years later, you crossed paths with Raju once again. Pure chance brought you back to the Oregon Reach as your, uh, as your mercenary crew took an ill fated contract against an enclave of pirates on the outskirts of Oregon space. The job went south, and you were the only survivor of your unit. Raju's lands happened to be on patrol nearby after rescuing you and helping to honor your fallen comrades. He offered you a job in the House of Rano Royal Guard. So it is that you find yourself reunited with your old mentor, preparing your ancestral blackjack for guard duty on the coronation day of Lady Kamea Rano. Now we get to choose how we look, and of course, we're gonna go use the correct call sign. First name Mango! Ilterra. Uh, where's the preset I liked? Where's the preset I liked? Did they change it? I hope they didn't change it. You, there you are. Just didn't see it. Now I need to change the presets. That. I need to turn you. There, okay, that's great. Scar, is that that? Okay. There. Mm hmm. Lighting. There. Clothing. There. Or was it no? Yeah, it was that one. Had to make sure. Keep it there.
I'll just keep it. However, I know I want those eyes. Nine will do. That works for me. Confirmation. Mango Marauder. Mango Ilterra. Three gunnery, two piloting, three tactics, three guts. I have no idea what those are actually for. Oh. Uh, I have no idea what those actually do yet. Uh, character background. Magistrate of Canopus. Uh, betrayed in a sphere mercenary. I got some of these uh, Reese's mini cups with white chocolate instead of uh, just milk chocolate. They're really good. I can't imagine it's a very nice noise to hear, but I'm just doing something while I wait for it to load. Oh, there we go. Command interface initiated. There we go. Okay, Mango Marauder. No, no. I'm not going to read everything he says, because he has an actual voice. I'll just read it on my own. You can pause it if you need to read it yourself. Until we can get uh, my own people. If I, I think you can get your own people. I don't know. job than escort duty. Like I was saying, I can't prove anything, but my gut tells me something's off. And a warrior trusts their instincts. All weapons committed. Enemy mech destroyed. Thank <laughs> you. 
me is like a daughter to me. And her late father, High Lord Tamati, was a good friend. All weapons committed. Pulls no punches, but she's been a loyal companion to Kamea since they were kids. Aside from you, there's no one I'd rather have by my side in a fight. Mm hmm. All weapons committed. Bam. Turn it down. Enemy unit destroyed. Jump jet there, face that way. Engaging jump jets. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Jump jets build a lot of heat, and that was more than your engine could handle. Head on into that water. We need to get you cooled off. And so we shall do. Jump jet not function, jump jet systems damage, I'm not inoperable. The melee targeting. Okay. Where is the melee button? Okay, okay, two. Okay, I see. Farther you move, more evasive charges you'll gain. Each charge makes you harder to hit. Mission successful. Yeah, I, I know a lot of them have voices, so I don't want to talk until I know they don't have a voice.
I remember the Oregon Reach of old, the time of the Great Expansion. I was just a boy then. Proudly we went forth, bringing the light of our coalition to so many systems. And for what? To see our great kingdom slowly waste away? Year after year, the Council deliberates while our economy falters, and the wolves bay at every door, while covetous neighbors plot against us. Well, I say, it can go no further. We are here today because if Lady Orana will not act, someone must. I know what I'm asking of you. You will face former comrades, or even loved ones, on the battlefield. I take up arms against my own niece. But remember, today we sacrifice so that tomorrow we can return our kingdom to its proper glory, to its proper strength. So should you fall tonight, know that you did so as true heroes of the Reach. To your stations! For the Directorate! And in we go. Command interface initiated.
Mm-hmm. No. I only know what happens. Whatever's happening here, I won't let it derail your coronation. Your people need you. Thank you, Raju. I will prove myself worthy of the faith you've placed in me. I only know what happens. I have no doubt. I only know what happens when you speak to those two. So I want to, uh, no, 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 no. I just want to save now. Before I do anything. Cooling down. Before I do anything, I wanted to make Copy sure I saved. In case it crashes again. I'm moving. You never know. Mm -hmm. Copy that. Out. I'll do what you ask. I almost held in your honor. We are preparing for Lady Arona's coronation parade when we got a word of a sediment along the Carmenta Road. Aye, hold the way to the southern gate. Need the way, sir, as you will fall in behind you and guide your six. Our mechs are overdue for maintenance. That isn't important right now. We need to worry about Lady Theorano's safety. Now, my lady, if you'll come with us. Tommy, girl! You don't have time for this! Take them! Kill the old man in the mech warrior! And take our Lady Arano alive! Fall back, Command. Get behind us. You didn't train me to cower, Rashu. Train me to fight. Safety is disengaged. Armor holding. Hmm. Um. Talk to me. Sensor lock. Uh. Roger that. And then they need to attack you. Triggering an alpha strike. Structure exposed. All right. Dude, that's not what I needed you to do. <sighs> Why did you do that? Why did you do that? Fire. Can we choose where we're going to fire? I don't think we can. Barely holds together. Okay. There we go. 
How can I help? Okay, behind him. On my way. I heard somewhere that you can shoot only from behind if you get behind them, and then that's so far a bit better. Can you? I wonder. You think destroyed. That was a critical hit, lad. No right. Tis but a scratch. You have my attention. I'm on my way. Now we're gonna keep killing him. That's who we need to kill. Pilot injured. Order a critical strike. Armor breach. Internal damage. Reverse it up and kill him. Just get it over with. I'm not sure how all that works if I can't target it. All weapons committed. Uh. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Mastiff. You've got my attention. Triggering an alpha Damn you for making me do that, son. Battle neck down. Down, that's good. Okay. Reading loud and clear. I'm on the move. Keep an eye on the heat, too. All weapons locked on and firing. That was deadly. Oh, dear. Come here! Come here! Can you hear me? It's happening here, too. The Royal Guards are killing one another in the holes. Lady Carossa's house guard just got gunned down in front of me. The Tully Pavilion is a slaughterhouse. Go to return the township to the armory. Your soldiers are using it as a rally point. I I heard Lord Simeus send his house guard there a few minutes ago. Someone's here. I have to move. Rally with forces you can and meet me at the turning grounds. Be safe. Way. Keep close and remember your training. That way. Like get ugly between that here and there. Okay. Confirmed. Holding here. Let her cool off. Aye aye. Heads up. Oh dear. We've got company. Oh, vehicles. Damn. Talk to me.
What's your percent chance to hit that exactly? Let's turn off, I guess that's how you turn them off. Turn off those two that have a lower chance to hit. No one over here. Roger that. Boom. There we go. Huh. Vehicle down. The poor bastards. Nice. Very nice. Always good not to get hit. I'm listening. And then, can you actually attack him? You have a ninety percent chance to hit with that. Okay. Try it. Confirmed. Kaboom! Didn't kill it, but kaboomed it. Just barely dinged my armor. My turn. Alright. Now you can attack it. 80% chance to hit. Do it. Oh shit. Oh dear. Is that a mech? Instead of... Uh... No, it has to be a vehicle, I believe. Orders. Get behind some cover and shoot him down. Roger that. Booyah. Never stood a chance. Vehicle down. Vehicle down. I hear you. Mm -hmm. Discharging weapons. Done and done. Another vehicle Another down. Enemy casualty. Another vehicle down. Get closer. Copy that. Even closer and take him out. You brought this on yourself. Duh. You were brave, I'll give you that much. All well, the vehicles are down. Do you hear? Read me. He says Spinoza, your uncle. Do you hear me? House is Spinoza is usurping the throne. 
Come here! I just watched in this Pedosa battle like plot through an audience for, for the civilians. This is happening! And it's happening now! Your loyalists have fallen back to the market district! That's where they're making their stand! What's left of the Royal Guard are doing their best! Well, there's something wrong with their battle mix! Wait! What's that sound? Oh, gods! Victoria Espino, okay. Oh dear. Attention, all Espinosa forces. This is Lady Victoria Espinosa. Lady Arano is to be apprehended and taken alive by my command. Fail to follow these instructions, and you will have me to deal with. Oh dear. Got my attention. You need to, uh... Go there. Affirmative. Cicada, Locust, Spider. Roger. Focus on him first. That was a critical hit, lad. Oh? We knocked him down. Oh, and he was injured, okay. Ouch! Ow! That had to hurt. did real damage. Steady lost evasiveness. Okay. Standing by. Confirmed. Just get rid of. Oh, cold shot. I see. I see. That's how you do it. Fire everything. Take him down. You chose the wrong side. Take him down. Now, on to you two. Attention, citizens of Coromadir 6. This is Lord Santiago Espinosa. 
With the unanimous support of the founding houses, I have assumed control of the Oregon Coalition. For your own protection, I urge you to remain calm and stay indoors until otherwise instructed. Hostile units, stand down, and you have my oath that you will not be harmed. Resist, and you will fight. Yeah. My father placed his faith in that man. I gave him my trust. He was family. Son of a bitch. Take him down. Next up, Kamea. Tell me what you need. Affirmative. Get behind him. I'm locked on the enemy's ship. Kamea! Do you read me? You very nearly did, Kamea. The city is lost. We have to get off this planet. And we need to do it now. We'll mourn for it later. The both of us. For now you need to move. I have a dropship waiting at Shepherd's Pass. I'm on my way there right now. Hurry and meet me there, please. You get to that ship, Alexander. I mean it. I will not lose you and my throne on the same day. Destroy the Espinosa vehicles, okay. We need to cool down. Oh, ouch. Okay. Orders. Try and get some evasion up. Copy that. Gotta let her cool off. to move right in there we go all right now turn around the left side of flank it's not the good thing to have no nah, not much damage at all not much at all. You've got my attention. I hope I do. It's confirmed. Vehicle down. The poor bastards. Right 
get up next to him. Okay, that's not good. That's not good to hear. Enemy unit destroyed. Damage minimal. Yes, I hear you. Oh, I see. Kaboom. Copy that. Talk to me. Fall in behind me. Take everything you have to get rid of host. Everything you need to. Okay, you. Me, actually. <laughs> Host is Raju's problem. At least for now. Do everything you need to to get rid of that turret. That's good. Good. You have my attention. That's not a good chance to hit. Yeah, that's a good idea. Engaging hostile. Ow. Not a lot of damage though, not bad, not bad. Orders. Unload. Get up behind him. And plow into the fucker. Okay. Got my attention. 
Next stop, move there. How's your heat? You're doing fine on heat. Roger that. Doing fine. Plow into the fucker. Aye, aye. Plow into the fucker. Take that as a lesson. He's running, he's running! The bastard breached my armor. I'm listening. I'm moving out. Taking the shot. Now you? There we go. I'm gonna have you actually hunker down. Brace. Can you do anything to really get rid of that thing? Just kill it. Get rid of it. Two down, one to go. Target destroyed. Are you still running? Jeez. Oh, we're having... I've lost a weapon. We're getting injured pretty bad on him. I need to get him out of there. You have my attention. I'll make it happen. And Engaging. BAM! Talk to me. Yeah, I need to move you away from there. Can't lose you. Come on. Oh, god damn it. I have to move, of course. Everything you have. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Yes, I hear you. Location confirmed. Mm -hmm. Try and keep him from hitting uh, Mastiff too hard. You've got my attention. My damned armor's busted.
All right. I'm listening. Melee him. <laughs> Unload everything you have. All weapons committed. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Knocked down. Good. Now I feel better about moving him up there regardless. Talk to, me. to try and finish him off. Roger. Take it down. Copy that. Thank the gods you made it, come here. Captain Halvorsen's prepping the engines now. In another five minutes, we'll be ready to depart. Alright. Thank you, Sir Rashu. Thank you both. I won't forget what you've done for me today. I promise you that. Oh, don't crash. Please don't crash. Oh! Uh. What's with the fucking pink battle mix? Mission successful. Oh no. Oh dear. Well, that just happened. It just happened. Holy shit.
Oh, hello. Easy there, Mango. You took a nasty crack on the head when you punched that. Don't worry, you're safe now. Name is Darius Oliveria. I'm the ex of the American Marauders. Hey, the Marauders! We're a mercenary outfit with ties to House of Rano. We did some work for High Lord Tamale way back when. I'll introduce you to Commander Markham, but he was on a supply run in the market district when the bombs fell. He, uh, well, he didn't make it. If it wasn't for your company, I'd be dead too. That's probably true, Dud. Don't mention it. After seeing what happened to Markham, it didn't feel right leaving you in the hands of this new directorate. When we picked up on your broadcast on the emergency band, we knew what we had to do. I think I already knew what happened, but... We found his mech. Completely cored out. Nobody survives. Hit like that. For what it's worth, I'm sorry. We supported the Royal Guard and a handful of deployments. And Sir Raj, you earned my respect many times over. Your death is a loss for us all. Yeah, our mech deck hauled what's left of him to the mech bay. It isn't pretty. You give him enough time, you can figure up just about anything. Try not to take the loss too hard. Gang said your mech show sign of deliberate sabotage. Whoever you had working on it really didn't number on the reactor. Punching that was the right move. Well, things aren't looking too hot around here. And with the coup and all, House Espinosa's director is the de facto government of the Oregon Reach. Sorry to have to tell you all this, but Lady Arano is dead. Her dropship was destroyed on takeoff. It's all over the news. Well, shit. <laughs> well, shit, indeed. Our sentiments exactly. We're getting the hell out of a Regan territory. I already booked transport in the first jump shit out. We're heading to a nice, quiet stretch of independent space all the way across the frontier. The Canopian border. Not a cheap trip, but we'll worry about how we're gonna pay for it later. As for you, well, you got options. According to your blood shit, you got family out in the magistracy of Canopus. Like I said, we're heading that way. If you want, I could look into booking you transport on a freighter. Maybe we can get you the rest of the way home. Isn't my home never has been. In that case, you can stay with us for the long haul. We get where we're going. We can drop you at the nearest planet, or you can make a place for yourself there. Of course, you'll need to pitch your I'll need you to pitch in your share of fuel, plus food, lodging, and repairs on your mech. Fair's fair, after all. Alternatively, you could find a you could find a place for yourself in the Marauders if you wanted to. Wouldn't take you long to work off your debt. And you ran with masters, so I know you got the chops. Then get over. Sleep on it. You've had a hell of a day. Got a long road ahead. I think I changed his voice like three times through that. Three years later.
But I think with that, when this loads, I'm gonna stop for you right now. Made it quite a bit further than I expected, given it was constantly crashing. But, um, it should work. Probably post Dead by Daylight on Saturday, and then this on a Sunday, but it's not guaranteed. Just waiting to get to the point where I can save. There we go. Command interface initiated. The Independent Prospector Leagues ain't here for your assistance, Commander. We're miners, not soldiers. We can't fight these bastards off on our own. That's what you're paying us for. Don't worry. Okay, your path platforms by. This isn't just about reclaiming what's ours. Majesty Medals kill hundreds of us when they try to jump our claim. We want you to make them bleed for what they've done here. Commander, the Op 4 is holding two of the IPL's mining platforms. The first designated Alpha is where they're keeping the turret generator. Move in fast and take it out. Those turrets hit hard and you want to neutralize them ASAP. Platform Bravo is the site of the Op 4's corporate security tower. Engage and destroy it. If they bring in a mech to protect you, take out that too. And circle on back and we'll collect our pay. That's right. I'm ready and waiting to authorize the transfer. Now go on, Commander. Hit these corporate pigs where it hurts. We'll be watching the action from here. And I think that right there is the perfect opportunity to stop. I know I literally just said this, but I'm gonna repeat myself. Save it twice. But uh, this is probably gonna come out on Sunday. That's not guaranteed. I'm gonna put out Dead by Daylight on Friday. And uh, yeah, hopefully this will be the new series now that Shadow Tactics should be done by now. So thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye bye. Dripping light. Sky